The team are delighted you've been so loyal declining all these meetings. They wanted me to tell you that they see you as key to the team going forward. Just don't get too comfy, otherwise I'll be out of a job. Okay, mate, I know we were expecting some new developments to come through, but I'm afraid to say that some of them have failed quality control. We're gonna need to tell the team what to redevelop via the R&D screen. High-speed straights, heady elevation changes, and dramatic corners. What is there not to love about today? It's qualifying day here at Spa-Francorchamps. Welcome to this visit to the Ardennes countryside. Spa-Francorchamps hosted its first Grand Prix back in 1925, and this historic track is loved by drivers and fans alike, and us here in the commentary box too. So it's a warm welcome from the Belgian Grand Prix. Spa-Francorchamps then, a historic 19-corner circuit with a lap distance of 4.35 miles. There's over 100 meters of elevation change here, and with long stretches of the lap spent flat out, a good top speed will be vital for success. It's time to take a look at our starting grid for today's race. Charles Leclerc lines up on pole position and the smooth operator Carlos Sainz completes the front row. Moving on to the rest of the grid, we have Russell, Perez, Hamilton, Fernando Alonso, Bottas, Stroll, Sargent, Norris, Verstappen, Oscar Piastri, Albon, Magnussen, Ocon, Gasly, Sonoda, Ricardo, Blue, and Nico Hulkenberg rounds off the grid. 
It's almost time for those five red lights to go out then. Let's see who can prevail today. Well, it's been a long time since I last worked with you. Good to see you again today, Anthony Davidson. Now, Ant, you know us. Professionals as we are, we don't listen to rumours all the time, just some of the time. And in the case of this driver, I think we were right to listen to those rumours because they were true. Seems like the rumours are true, Crofty. Now, the, the, the good thing is for the driver that if you've potentially signed or had chats with a team that are going to further your career, that's all well and good. But the problem it immediately creates within your own team now is that potentially the team stop giving you inside information and therefore you're not privy to that knowledge of where the car's going in terms of its future development. Here we go then, the formation lap gets underway and the excitement here is building as we near ever closer to the start of the race. Which team will come out on top? Who's got their strategies right for today's race? Well, we'll soon find out. Okay, now stay alert for threats around you. DRS is being enabled this lap. You can use DRS when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone.
arteries in the pits. Okay, we want you to pit this lap, so push now, push. Last stop, no more scheduled pit stops, let's go. Charging it up, please. Great stuff, mate. You hit the target well there. Nice one. It's a long way to go in this race, though, so keep your head down.
And that's the end of the race. We'll see you in Park Fermi. A difficult race then on one of the all-time classic circuits, but they persevered to take the win here today. They led from lights out to the flag at the end, and their race victory was never in doubt, was it? Brilliant stuff by them. Ferrari are at it again. An excellent performance at today's Grand Prix, and they're certainly a team that know what they're doing out there.